A black guy walks into a bar, and the bartender says, Get the f out. Malobius! Malobius! You can't say that! Sorry guys, Happy New Year! Belobius thinks every day is New Year. I caught him with champagne this morning. Guy was eight mimosas deep when I awoke. Not gonna lie though, I had Belobius smack down an eight leg heater parlay and that shit smacked. So shout out to Belobius. Belobius paid the rent this month. Can we Belobius? Can we break Belobius? Willamont! What's good boys? Good to see you guys as always. Ooh, we need a we need a redemption game in today's Wheel of Mutt. Last week was a tough loss. Lost by about 15. Couldn't get the offense going. We were able to complete the challenge wheel, so Nick Gates was able to stay on the squad. But other than that, we didn't get to add any new players. And I'm pretty adamant that Dak Prescott's time as a San Francisco 49er and a Wheel of Mutter is over. I think we do need a hot route master quarterback. I don't know about set feet lead yet. I'll figure that out, but yikes. Dak, um, I couldn't get the job done without those special fancy routes. Puka Nakua was incredible. Derrick Henry was incredible. Jamar and Zay Flowers had a great game too. Tight end Vita Vea was wishy-washy. He did drop a butt naked wide open pass, but it is what it is. Defensively, we're star studded. Uh, uh, there are so many good players on this defense. I obviously need better corners. Derwin James is getting a little dated, but I expect he'll get a card at some point. Champ Bailey played well. D-line's a little outdated, but I think we're chilling. I think we're just fine. The main focus of today is Dak Prescott, buddy. I gotta get you up out of there. We're three and one on the season, so two more wins takes us to the playoffs, but two more losses. We have to restart the season. That would not be fun. Let's see if the wheel will let me have a new quarterback. I'm sorry, Dak. Honestly, you no, know, Dak got us the three one. I shouldn't be complaining about it so much. A 90 to 91 team of the week play. My decision is made. You know who's had an awesome season and I don't ever get to show love to on Wheel of Mutt? Mike Evans. Mike Evans, nasty. I love watching him with Baker. 91 overall. It's not the best card in the world. You know, there's 94 overall wide receivers in the game, but he's six foot five. You can't take that away from him. He is so much bigger than Zay Flowers. Zay Flowers scares me, bro. That guy's a walking fumble. It's Mike Evans' turn. So now we've got Jamar Chase, Puka Nakua, Mike Evans. Honestly, this team's kind of nasty offensively. Great wide receivers, great tight end. We just don't have a great quarterback. Also, low-key, if I got another tight end, I might take Vita Vea back to backup and then put him at fullback again because I miss that. I miss Vita Vea at fullback. All right, boys, our first wheel spin. 91 overall. Mike Evans got a big boy wide receiver. I love to see it. Our second wheel spin. Oh, my God. I'm a genius. Can we talk about how I'm a genius for a second? A while back, I pulled 79 overall Will Anderson. And in my head, I was like, eventually, this might pay off for a pack of so I'm just gonna sit him there and we'll figure it out. Well, guess what? There's only two Will Anderson cards in the game. There's 79 Will Anderson and there's 93 Will Anderson. 92 speed, 94 tackle, great block shed, great finesse moves. He's a speed rusher maniac. And I want him on this team. I'm not gonna put any abilities on him. I already really like the abilities that we have. Will Anderson is the first super dominant edge rusher I've had in a long, long time. Thanks, Nick Bosa. I am gonna keep Nick Bosa in because the meme is just too great to let it die. But Will Anderson, my new starting level. Left end. Gotta make sure he is my rush left end as well. And look at how powerful the zero chill cam on him is. He's boosted to a 95 overall. 92 speed, 96 tackle, play rec, block shed, power moves, finesse moves. And our third wheel spin all will be on the line in today's episode. Not to mention, I did lose last episode. I don't want to lose back to back. I like this. I'll have a choice on the player. We just gotta hope it's a good number. Hey, Google, pick a random number between 1 and 100,000. Here's a random number. 50,212. 50,212. Maybe that 212 will come in handy. We can basically spend 50K on one player. I'm going to go right guard. I got to get Elijah Wilkinson out of here. We're not going to be able to afford a 90 overall, but hopefully we can get an 89. Look at that. There's a few options, actually. Brandon Scherf, Tevin Jenkins, Dave DeCastro. Scherf or Jenkins? You guys Jaguars fans or Bears fans? There's no such thing as a Bears fan. Let's go. <laughs> I'm, guys, I'm joking. No, you guys got a really good program over there. I'm, really, I'm joking. Brandon Scherf will be our I actually like this. He's a better run blocker than pass blocker. And that's that's kind of what I like, especially with my Derrick Henry back here. We need a good, we need a better game for Derrick Henry. I got away from the run game. So I was struggling. I dug myself a hole. That was not fun. On the line today, 89 overall Brandon Scherf. 91 limited Mike Evans team of the week wide receiver. And the best edge rusher we've ever had, Will Anderson. Don't you forget the challenge reel. Challenge reel was huge last episode. I barely got it with seconds winding down okay we just need the entire game's number one fantasy play uh, why is that mccaffrey in 96 overall dude i saw that earlier in the game dude that card is insane 
Starts out with a big run, CMC. Tackled by Gronk. He's gonna go no hunt. All right, let's play ball then. Somebody's gotta get home, right? Let's go! Second and 10, nice work. I'm scared of this CMC. Okay, play action. I have this. Oh! Nick Bosa! White, black, or purple, it don't matter. Non-prestige Nick Bosa's coming for you, buddy. He's got that ghost to mud Andrew Luck. I haven't got to use him yet. No! Nick Bosa! Take your prestige and shove it up your ass! Let's go, baby! That's a safety! Dude, I was rushing three on both those plays. That is a criminal bad beat. And he gets a flag on a safety punt. I didn't even know you could do that. All right, boys, first and 10. <laughs> Let's go get that 40 bomb. Who's where? I smell Vita Vea. Nice work, Gronk. Oh my God, Vita Vea. You're lying! You're lying! You're lying! You're lying! Wait a minute, we need the two point. If we don't get the two point, it makes this a lot harder. Vita Vea, whip route. Oh my God, I could not marry you. Vita, you were questionable last game, but now, the old rock. Come on, it's 10 to zero. Wait a minute, the safety changed things. I can afford to miss one two point conversion, actually. That safety is Galaxy Man, bro. I have to let him score. I'm never gonna get my 40 ball if I don't let him score. I don't want it to be too obvious. I want him to feel like he did something sick. Okay, this is perfect. Just take bad angles. Just don't get quite to him. All right, let's just pull Kyle Hamilton out of the play. Find him, find him, find him. He's there. Dude. <laughs> His name is okay, you won. I gotta blow this up. Oh, wait a minute. I'm speaking too soon. I have no reason to think he sucks. He missed one pass and he, he got a very unlucky safety. I'm going the same exact play. Here it is. He's still in man coverage and Vita Vea is too fucking... Vita Vea leads the, leads the game in fantasy points right now. There's no question about that. Dude, would you guard him? Would you guard him? Would you guard him before you end up on TikTok? Three for three, 84 yards and a touchdown. Okay, so now he probably takes Vita Vea so I can hit the deep one to Jamar Bendit. Ayo! Give me the 40 line. It's today's the day. Today's the day. I gotta get the two point conversion. Dude, I've got 16 points in the first quarter. Today's the day. And this odd big one. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. 16 to 8. All right, I already used my freebie right there. All right, let's stay in it. Just in case he's actually good, we have to, like, actually stay locked in. Probably play action. I could probably sack him. Mm, no, you didn't! Let's go Samuel Blitz. He hasn't seen it yet. Oh, I don't have my substitutions. Shoot. I need Gronk in on this. Just get mossed! I did not just get fucking mossed! Stop! Here he goes Damn, this is actually gonna be a game. Here's the thing though, if he scores here and tries to go for two again and I can stop him, I'll be right back in a really good spot. First and goal, I think I bagged this anyway. He runs it, it's Derwin. He RPOs it. Get off your- That's why those are so good, by the way. Cause Gonzo just got off his block so well and I still didn't have the angle to make that play. Is this the same thing? He's gonna throw it. Yup! Come on! That was a heat-seeking missile with Kyle Hamilton. Fuck you. Honestly, Gronk is a really good guy for this. But still, these things are so diabolical. Oh, let him touch it. That was so free. <laughs> and I got it anyway. Would you pick my man up? You're getting cooked by a 315-pound tight end, and I'm mad about it. Four receptions, 98 yards. Does he have a touchdown, though? Yes, he does. Yes, he does. I don't know why they didn't show it right there. He definitely has one. No card for you to fail. Or I cook you over and over. Right I'll keep throwing it to him. If you think I'm above throwing that to Vita Vea, you're completely wrong. Right. Dak, stepping up in the pocket. Ooh. Dak Prescott. I'm going to go Jamar Chase Whip. I think he's... Jamar. Ooh. I'm not in. He's there. 22 to 14. I got to go for two again. Left side run, Derrick Henry. Oh, great push. Derrick. Henry, he doesn't have momentum. Derrick Henry should be running him over every time on that. No more RPOs, please. He has absolutely nothing. That was almost the second safety of the game. Goes McCaffrey, who marches forward for five. This is a really good nice strategy. At least he's in no huddle. Oh, he gets sacked by Will Anderson. Third and 31. I have only four people in coverage here. I'm guessing pass. This is a hot blitz, though. Who's it going to be? Good defense. Adrian Phillips. Fourth and 31. He finds himself with a hole. Gonna go on Gonzo. Got a blitz, Bosa. Oh, I just barely got that. He's got nothing. 
Hey, I got it. Can we house it? Oh, free form. Henry. What a move! I'm hurting! One more! Stay up! There it! Stay up! Oh my god, this is Dak's best game of his life. Shit. Shit. Second ago. You know what? This is good. I can get more fantasy points. Just gonna go Derrick Henry for a little fantasy point there. 10 for 11, 200 yards and three touchdowns. He calls a timeout. He does not like what he sees. Maybe I'll do it again. Maybe I'll do it again! Linebackers can't animate! Two point conversion. I think Derek Henry or maybe Mr. Vita Vea. Right there. <laughs> Dude, I'm like, I don't need no hot route master. Last guy's team was much better. I, I'll give him I'll give him that. That Julius Pepper's strong safety was fun. How do I let him score here? Do I do like a corner blitz or maybe like try to man his corner up? It's harder than you think to let somebody score without making it obvious. It is genuinely difficult. Okay, I'm gonna bring my safety down and pretend like I'm using something. I'll pretend like I'm on 81. Yeah, I'm on 81. That's all I care about. Just a big 81 guy. If Andrew Luck could throw the damn football, maybe we could, maybe I could get him. I gotta make him, I gotta make him think I missed. Oh. That was kind of convincing, no? Were you guys convinced? I actually... That was it. I gotta stop separating the wealth between Vita Vea and Derrick Henry, though. I just gotta go Vita Vea. This is great, actually. Stat pad, the uh, fantasy points. Because his Andre Reid actually has an absurd stat line. So I'm not certain that I have the challenge. The closest I've ever been to opening... Pack, finally. As a reminder to anyone who does not know. Wow, and he's outside kicking. About a month ago, I'd say. Wait, catch this. Alberto. Nice. About a month ago, I purchased this. I got two of them, actually. It's Panini Immaculate Collegiate Football. They're like 650 bucks per box. There's only six or seven cards in the box. I'm going to open it. I'm going to give away every single card I pull, and we can add one player from the box to the team. So I actually really hope that one of the players we pull has a good Madden card. It's not guaranteed. He's going to leave. Derek! Oh, but there's pressure in my face. I can't... Dude, I really hope he continues to run this man cover. He has a linebacker manned up on Derrick Henry every time, and that free form will always be there. Vita Vea? Oh, my God. Dak, where were you last game? Who are you? You are throwing lasers into, into pockets that... Whatever. He continues to use the opposite side of the field, which is so funny to me. I'm only throwing to Vita Vea. Come on, boys. We're so close. Vita Vea whip route. Follow it, boys. Enjoy. Enjoy the route running masterclass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at those feet. Look at the finesse, the subtlety, the expertise, the flair, the knack, the panache, the dash, the flourish, the polish, the skillfulness, the adeptness, the artistry, the artfulness. Snap. Vita Vea, I own you. Might as well kick this one short. Don't do it, bro. Don't quit right now, dude. I will cry myself to sleep if you know. Something tells me he knows. It would be my fault, too, because I've missed two two-point conversions. Like, I could have. Would you stop it, Andre? He's going to have an insane stat line. I'm actually competing a little bit on this fantasy point. He has absolutely nothing. I pray he throws this. Go, Will Anderson. He didn't get the ball back up. That's intentional grounding. You have to get the ball across the first down marker or some, some weird rule like that. Nope. So that's an intentional grounding. You have to be outside the pocket and you have to get the ball past the first down marker. <laughs> or maybe it's just past the pylon. <laughs> or maybe it's just past the... Oh my gosh. Maybe it's just past the line of scrimmage. Uh, yeah. But I don't know. Regardless, he doesn't get it. He's gonna Huckleberry Finn one. All right, I have to, I have to let him have something here. Okay, we're going to send a blitz. We're going to QB spy two players. And then Gonzo is going to man up. So it's pretty much going to be... Oh, 11. Look at 11. Stop dropping back. Stop it. I'm going to make this so easy for him that he can't fuck it up. I have to. I have to make this one so easy that he can't fuck it up. QB spy, 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 QB spy. I'm on Hamilton. No, QB spy. Shit. Did I get it off? Please, dude. I'm going to cry myself to fucking sleep if you quit right now. Please don't. No! No! I, I tried so hard. I can be spying eight people. No! No!
my God, I'm so mad. Despite not getting to see the stats, I am very confident that Vita Vea was the winner. He had so many receptions, so many yards, multiple touchdowns. And he also had a lot of two-point conversions. He had like six points off of two-point conversions, I think. Hit him with two whip routes. I hit him with that hitch. Andre Reed was having a very big game, but I think Vita Vea might have been in the... He might have been in the 40s for fantasy points right there. Amazing game, Vita Vea. We do get one pack from the store for completing our challenge. We don't have to salvage any players since we won. So I'm going to go with the Triumph Elite pack. Looking for potentially, uh, what am I looking for? Maybe a fullback, maybe a tight end. The packs will decide for me. And Oliver's already on the team, so that's a bummer. Quay Walker's nice, but my linebackers are nicer. And ultimate kickoff, Damian Harris. Sorry, buddy. You're not making the lineup. And if nothing else, boys, I do get a spin on the Rage Quit Wheel. I definitely, definitely deserve this one. That was the most painful Rage Quit of my life. He knew, bro. He had to have. I refuse to believe he didn't, though. 25,000 coins to spend on one player. Markets? Markets tanked, man. That ain't bad. Question should we take? Maybe we just get a true fullback for 25k so that Najee Harris doesn't have to be in. I use fullbacks a lot on this team. You could, I could pick up Franco Harris or Mike Allstott. I did just get Mike Evans, so let's go Franco Harris. And he's going in for Najee anyway, so 87 overall Franco Harris. Honestly, just a solid fullback um, until we get a better tight end. Once I get a better tight end, I'm putting Vita Vea back at fullback. I really want him for those I formation runs. At the end of the day, this is a massive Wheel of Mutt win. We get Mike Evans, we get Franco Harris, we get this insane Will Anderson Jr. who played a great game. We get to keep Brandon Scherf, and we move to four and one, so I am now one game away from the playoffs. All right, boys, the 90 overall squad deck <laughs> threw like five touchdowns, four touchdowns. Oh my God, if I had just got my two-point conversion. I didn't even need a two-point conversion. I could have kicked two PATs on my two missed two-point conversions. Because I had a safety. I could have kicked PATs. Oh, that hurts even worse. I don't even want to talk about it. All right, boys. I love you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. It was a dummy heater. And I will see you boys in the next video. Peace out, gentlemen.